First, we perform this multiplication, 7 over 3 multiplied by 3, the 3s cancel each other out, and only 7 remains. In the end, 21 divided by 7 gives us 3. But this answer is not correct because we did not follow one of the most important rules in mathematics called the order of operations. The order of operations tells us that when we face a mathematical expression, we cannot start solving it from anywhere we like, instead, we must follow a specific order called the correct order of operations. The correct order of operations is known by a short acronym called PEMDAS. P stands for parentheses. E stands for exponents and roots. M stands for multiplication. D stands for division. A stands for addition and S stands for subtraction. According to PEMDAS, in any mathematical expression, we first calculate parentheses, then exponents and roots, then multiplication and division, and finally addition and subtraction. Remember that multiplication and division have equal priority. In any expression that has both multiplication and division, we move from left to right and perform whichever we reach first. This rule also applies to addition and subtraction. Now, with these explanations, let's solve the question from the beginning of the video. But before solving it, please like the video and subscribe to the channel, and if you have any questions, ask them in the comments. 21 divided by 7 over 3, multiplied by 3. In this expression, there is both division and multiplication. According to PEMDAS, multiplication and division have equal priority, so we move from left to right and perform whichever operation we encounter first. In this expression, if we move from left to right, we reach division first, so we perform the division first and then the multiplication. To solve this part, we use the KCF rule. K stands for keep, C stands for change, and F stands for flip. The KCF rule is a simple rule for dividing fractions. According to this rule, we keep the first number as it is, change the division sign to multiplication, and flip the second number. According to the KCF rule, we keep 21 as it is, change division to multiplication, and flip 7 over 3 to become 3 over 7, so we get 21 multiplied by 3 over 7, 21 divided by 7 gives us 3, and 7 divided by 7 gives us 1, then 3 times 3 equals 9, finally, 9 multiplied by 3 equals 27 which is our final answer. Thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, like the video, if you have any questions, ask them in the comments, and I will definitely answer. Share it with your friends. And subscribe to the channel.